spend the rest of my life with the same one, same one. Ain't no I and T. I'ma bring you good love, just come with me. Baby, you're all the company. I hey, y'all. I know y'all haven't seen me in a good hot minute, but I'm still your favorite girl, A. Marie. And y'all. I'm gonna put in a clip somewhere right here where y'all can see all the boxes of new makeup that I have. So I decided, you know what, let's do a declutter. If you haven't seen my comeback video, then I will link it up above as well. Um, just talking about where I've been, what's life been like, and all that good stuff. Um, so my comeback video. I'm about to do a declutter so that we could finally pull in some of this new makeup and play with it. You guys, I have like 20 BoxyCharm boxes, like 20 that I have yet to even look at. And I'm going to do a whole BoxyCharm unboxing with every last one of the boxes in one video some will be a giveaway to you guys and some i will keep just depends on what's in there so if you want to see what all i'm decluttering and how this declutter is gonna go then just keep watching but before we go any further i would love for you to stop while watching the video and hit that subscribe button you don't even have to pause the video Okay, hit that subscribe button and right next to it, click that notification bell and click all so you'll be notified with all of my new uploads. Y'all, I'm back. I just got a brand new ring light and I finally stepped my game up and got a newer ring light. Okay, while I wasn't doing YouTube, while I wasn't here with you guys, I broke it. And y'all know I had that ring light for like four or five years. My ass been taking these weight gain pills and then, you know, got an ass and a belly and I bent over to throw something away and my ass knocked the whole ring light over and glass broke everywhere. So let's work, let's get into it. I'm gonna start off by decluttering these drawers because you guys know I love these drawers. Let me turn my light so we can have some more light. And this is a good way to put this, this new ring light to the test. Can y'all see? Can y'all see? Yes, you can see. Okay, so I do have a trash bag. Y'all, y'all know my makeup is like 10 plus years old. So, some things I will be throwing away. Some things I will be putting to give away. Just depends. Um, I have all these sponges. I think these are all good. I had got these sponges, these right here, from this company off of Amazon. And it came with like a full bucket, and I just kept the bucket. So I think I'm good. Nothing new, you guys. I still stay in an apartment complex. There's still children outside. Nothing new, okay? <laughs> just ignore it. Okay, you guys, I turned on the fan. My kid just came in here thinking he was going to bring out the basketball goal. But I told him, uh, no, no, mommy's working. Hopefully, y'all can't hear the fan. Okay, so this first little drawer we have, I do have some lip glosses from some small businesses. Um, I have some, Nick. what are these called? Butter glosses. I do have Bit of Honey. And then this one is cinnamon roll. Y'all, I, th I think I just picked up another cinnamon roll not knowing that I had it. Um, This Maybelline. I'm finally going to get rid of these. If you guys remember these, Lord, like, y'all are really my OGs. Because I bought these when I first started YouTube. And I was a super fan for the Maybelline baby lips. Let me smell it. Yeah, nah, I'm going to throw this away. I'm going to keep the two butter glosses. I'm going to keep my Shelly's Daughter Beauty. I'm going to keep all those. 
I do have Ashley. I have Clear Quartz. I have, I don't know the name of this one. And I have Vanilla Latte. I'm going to keep those because those are basically new. I think I'm going to go ahead and throw this e.l.f. lip gloss away. I had this for a good minute. Alexia's Beauty Watermelon Lip Plumping Oil. I'm going to go ahead and keep this and see if I use it. This one is from the Makeup Intervention. And this one's in Chocolate Tear. I'm going to keep that one. And then Carmelo. I'm going to go ahead and keep. Baby, I'm recording right now. My bad, you guys. So the second one is going to be all my Maybelline Super Stays. I have, this one is the Caramel Collector, Coco, Hazelnut, Mocha, Huntress, Lover, Fighter, and Loyal, loyal List. Every last one of these today. Y'all know I'm a fan for my Maybelline. So, the next drawer, this one's going to be hard, you guys. I have my Too Faced Sweet Peach Lip Glosses. This one is in Tickle Me Peach. This one is Poppin' Peach. Let me smell these two. Stop. Y'all Prada is in here. Oh, these are still good. Prada, stop it. Oh, y'all, these are still good. Stan. Okay, so with my elves, I never opened this one. This is Moody, and it's a liquid, a lip lacquer. Prada. This is a lip plumping gloss. This one is in Mocha Twist, never used. This one is in Pink Cosmo, never used. This one as well is a liquid lipstick. So this one here is a liquid lipstick and this is a matte liquid lipstick and praline. I have yet to use any of these. Now, these, you guys, these are going to be hard ones. These are the LA Color High Shine Lip Glosses and they're the, uh, they are the colored lip glosses. This one is in Doll Face. Y'all, I don't think that one's no more good. We have another doll face. I think this one was my favorite color. That one smells all right. We have Snuggle. Oh, I love these, you guys. Yeah, that one's still good. Maybe that one doll face was an older one. Um, baby Cakes. Love it. Yes, these all still smell good. This one here is Hyper. So let's see. Y'all, I think I'm going to go ahead and drop Hyper. It's almost smelling like that first doll face. All right, so with this drawer of lip liners, these are the lip liners I already used versus the ones I'm testing or working out or trying to get to. So what I'm going to do right here is I'm going to go through these and see which ones I want to keep and which ones I want to get rid of. don't know. So this part, I'm just going to fast forward because it's a lot of lip liners. I need to see if they're still good. Okay, so, so far, I'm only getting rid of this Wet n' Wild Gel Lip Liner in the shade Lay Down the Moths. You guys, I like it. It's a thick pencil, like the retractable pencil, but look at the shade versus on my lips. I don't know. I really want to throw it away, but now that I look at it, Maybe it will work. So I'm going to keep it so far. So that means I didn't throw none of them away. So that was just a waste of a clip. <laughs> I did find three 
that aren't even open so this first one is by color edge it's the eyeliner pencil for some reason and the color is there is no color name so it's just a eggplant purple and then I have the lip liner from LA colors in the shade natural you guys I haven't even used these they were in the used and then the Koki in chocolate and we don't even have Koki in our stores anymore so that sucks moving on I doubt any of these change these are my bullet lipsticks this one's from Fenty and this one's called Renzelda don't know very dark mauvey Ooh, yes yeah I don't think none of these are gonna change I also have Velvet Teddy from Mac which is one of my faves not going nowhere I got Rebel from Mac I got two Viva La Nikki's. I got Nikki's nude to keeper, and then the pink print keeper. I don't think none of these are gonna change. I also got Heron from Mac. Y'all, I think these are the only Mac lipsticks I own. This is a Viva La Ariana Grande and she looks like that very vampy right and then hue hue snob and hue and snob were my first two mac bullet lipsticks that i ever owned i have my gerard cosmetics in buttercup and not going nowhere still haven't even used it i think the same thing with this drawer these are my l'oreal's my morphe my Nabla, my Nabla is in Coco, very new. My two Morphe's, which is Taunt and True Story, not going nowhere. And my Infallibles, where's the names? Okay, I got Dose of Color, no, Dose of Coco. I have Shakedown. I love these type of liquid lipsticks, you guys. I got Rosewood. I also have Box of Chocolate. And then Nudist. And then I have my only Solo Dolo NYX Powder Puff liquid lipstick, which is in Cool Intentions. My Maybellines in the NYX drawer. This one is red for me. Yes. <laughs> Beautiful matte. I do have um, two Wet n Wilds and I think I haven't used these correct. Haven't used these yet. So I have Never Nude and then Cinnamon Spice Bullet Lipsticks. They look like that. I can't wait to use them. A lot of my makeup, you guys, that's over here is like a lot of new stuff. Um, this one is Plum For Me. And these are the Maybelline Rouge Lipsticks. So, I doubt any of these go. Spice For Me. Yup. This one is Pink For Me. I remember having the whole collection and I did a whole lip swatch video. Um, if I can find it, I'll link it down below. It's on my channel. And this one's mauve for me. I ended up decluttering the ones that I really didn't like, but these were the ones left that I did. They're very creamy and matte, and I love them. All right, this next drawer is all my lip, lip, lip these are all my liquid lipsticks and lip glosses so i am going to retire all three of these liquid lipsticks i do have new formulated liquid lipsticks that you guys will see later already that i plan on keeping um i am going to get rid of golden state of mine 
I think I'm going to keep this one. can't remember the name of this one. I'm going to keep this one. I don't put the names on my own, which is kind of dumb, dumb of me. Um, this Christmas one, I'm going to keep. That's like a galaxy color. Rave, I think I'm going to go ahead and get rid of Rave. I have a couple of other Raves. Let me see what this one was. Mm. Yeah. I could do it out. I have so many of my own lip glosses, you guys. It's crazy. Um, and I have Ice Me Out. And I have Diamonds. And I think I'm going to keep both of those. Moving on to the last drawer right here. Boom, once again, all mine. I'm going to transfer the ones, if I keep, if any, over here into this one. This was a liquid lipstick. Don't want. That was about the first formulated liquid lipsticks I made. And I don't want it. I think this one is still good, though. Oh, this was truffles, I think. This is a lip gloss. I will keep it. I don't own truffles no more, though. Would that be dumb for me to keep? Because I can't sell it to you guys. This one I'm going to get rid of. It was the first liquid lipstick that I owned and made. Both of these, they're going to go. Um, We do have, I think this one is wealthy. I'm going to keep. This one is a Marie Chocolate Delight. I'm going to keep. This one was... I don't sell this one no more. This one was... The drip gloss, that's what it was. Yeah, that's what it was. The drip, I'm going to go ahead and get rid of it. Royalty, I don't sell royalty anymore with the glitter top, but I will keep it. Because it's just a clear gloss, so that means we have one empty drawer. I'm going to go ahead and throw my packaging away. That's the Nabla packaging. I'm going to keep my hand sanitizer. This one was a St. Patrick's Day clear lip gloss with a whole bunch of glitter on the bottom. That was limited edition in my shop. I'm going to go ahead and let that one go. Yeah. Okay. And my oil. You guys, I still sell this body and face oil. And I'm going to throw this one away because I do have this one inside the house i keep it in my bathroom i was keeping this one because i do have a mini skincare refrigerator that i never plugged up so i'm gonna go ahead and let that one go but the facial oil is good you guys y'all should try it it is on my website this one on the other hand is a lot of mascaras that are open that i haven't used in a while so let's see are any of them dried out both of these are the two face better than six that one's still wet look you guys is that two different packaging this one's a little bit more purpley than this one and this one's more pinker um but both of those are still wet which is surprising i haven't worn makeup in a minute my stick that I got in a box of charm. This one is a Good Vibes Mascara. It's still wet. The It Cosmetics Superhero. Boop. Still wet. And this one is real good, you guys. I like this one. Now, the Essence Get Big Lash. You guys, I love this. I hope it's still good. Yes. This is good for an affordable price. My Lala Fox Touch Up Mascara. Still wet. I'm super excited because I love Lala Fox. And then I got a little mini Too Faced Better Than Sex. And it still looks wet. Boom. And then in this drawer, I do have the Fenty, what are these called? Full Frontal Mascara that I got in a boxy charm. Still wet. Baby, we keeping all these. We have two in this drawer, which is my Maybelline Big Colossal Big Shot Mascara. It's dried, look like. It don't seem like 
it got much left in it and this is the makeup shayla one oh my god i'm so sad that was the collab with makeup shayla now my l'oreal bambi eye mascara this is the waterproof i didn't really like this one that much like everybody else i really wanted to but i didn't so we cleared out that one i wouldn't get it through that that one away this drawer right here is my products and my niece's products gloss by lay this is a body mist and then here are some lip glosses that i made in this little container i have irreplaceable which is the chanel inspired lip gloss i have best friend which looks like this here is truth the louis vuitton inspired lip gloss all these lip glosses are sheer tint exposed is a sheer tint sheer nude tint i'm keeping all these because these are cute nikki yum and i don't know if i will be bringing these this was the liquid lipstick that i made i'm gonna go ahead and toss that one but these lip glosses y'all everything keep jumping out the trash these lip glosses for right now are not on my website because i'm trying to come out with different styles of lip glosses um so if they still have any left on my website they are marked down on clearance because they're being discontinued so what i did was bring over my lip glosses my liquid lipsticks and my lip liners so let me show you guys what lip glosses is in my collection so and this is the new tubes don't mind the logo because that is not how retail logo is looking i just put it on there just because this one here is princess princess looks like that yes baby a pale pink yes so what i'm gonna do is i think i'm gonna sit them in here in this drawer like this this little cute drawer as i swatch them and show you guys i just want to show you guys i think i need to do like a full sit down video on all of my lip glosses that i am selling on my website oops and do like a full swatch video let me know if you guys will want that so this one here is melanin she looks like this this is somewhat like yeah i just wiped it with the makeup wipe and didn't mean to get it hung but this is something like what the logo actually looks like on retail glosses so this is melanin this one is Stardust. Stardust is a clear shimmer. See how she reflects? Oh, so pretty. And Stardust is watermelon scented. Um, Baby Girl is caramel scented. Melanin is watermelon scented. Yeah, I wear my lip glosses damn near every day, but... I had them sitting up. This is Revenge. Smoky Gray. Silver. Whoa. Yes. Yes. Get into it. I do have Strawberry Acai. Sheer. With Strawberry Slices. The black one. I will scroll the name across the screen. Because this one. I'm like debating on if I should. Oops. If I should bring it to the site or not, don't mind the messiness because mine don't have the stoppers because I lost them. And this is that one, True Black, with sparkles in it. I be forgetting that I don't put stoppers in mine because all I do is like product swatches and stuff with mine. So, yeah, that's how my mind works. And my glosses don't come in this gold top i just buy them from amazon and use them for my own personal this one is mamacita full of red 
glitter pure red gloss little bit of a tint she's not packed with punches of red like she's not a stunning red gloss she's a tint of red this one here is naked a true nude yes i love naked y'all i love me some naked caramel scented pink diamond you guys okay so this is what the actual logo is like and my lip glosses does come in these tubes the big fat chubby tubes here is pink diamond and she is a buildable nude she's caramel scented as well here is glitter bomb she has holographic glitter holographic butterflies she is full of glitter but she is a clear gloss just packed with glitter and if I'm not mistaken she is peppermint scented here is tanger y'all I had to come out with a orange y'all look at this logo I thought these were so cute too I play with my logo fonts on my own personal lip glosses just to see what I want to have for retail can you so cute right so here is tanger bright ass orange right she's buildable as well oops sorry she's buildable as well and she is caramel scented a lot of my nude glosses are caramel scented some are watermelon scented and then one of my faves is money maker baby she is a nude you hear me a nude and this was another logo i was testing out super cute right and money maker looks like this i love money maker oh you could wear her on your own yes so if you guys want me to do a sit down in a full blown lip swatch video with my glosses my lip liners and my liquid lipsticks let your girl know comment down below right now you know you can comment as you're watching the video as well just scroll all the way down to the bottom where you see the comment section start and you can comment as you're watching the video but here's all of my glosses i'm leaving in this cube right here all right so now we have my liquid lipsticks which i think i may put right here because they're too long to fit in these drawers but i still want them to be seen so i think i'm gonna put them there and i'm gonna go through really fast and swatchy swatch them for you number 10 bear bear like bear naked number five bubble yum like this one goes great with the lip gloss nikki yum that's why i named them like that so here is bubble yum and if you guys would like let me know i'll do a lip liner swatch video like on my lips bubble yum is this one right here this is nikki yum the lip gloss she's disc discontinued too so if there's any left on the site get you some can you see those two paired together this one is number eight ebony my favorite number eight ebony boom swatched y'all you could tell i use this one right you could tell i use it a lot look at it ebony she's a true brown number nine nude number nine nude. oh let me show you guys my packaging she looks like that has the number on it has the ingredients on it cruelty free 12 months net weight everything is printed on the box both sides 
I just threw the name on it instead of just saying like zero six <laughs> so this one's nude very nude she still works on my skin tone she's just a little light but you could do ebony on the outer portion nude right in between and then a nude lip gloss like my lip gloss naked will match good with ebony and ebony and nude so here's naked here's ebony and nude i'm gonna swatch naked right in between the two so you guys could get the lip combo idea so you see how that works let me show you money maker on the other side do we get it do we get it girl i'll do a whole video for you guys if y'all want just let your girl know all right this one is number four brick i love brick as well i have a color for everyone this one's brick girl 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 if y'all ain't got these creamy lip liners yet you tripping i even have number 12 midnight can we guess what midnight is girl midnight is a black and the thing i love about my lip lip liners they're so creamy that midnight could be used for our eyeliner she could be used to smoke out a black smoky eye you can also use her as a the black lip liner and pair it pair her with my black lip gloss which once again name will be across the screen because this one and the red one i have red with chunky glitter and then a pure red the red is mama sita and mama sita and hot girl this one i want to say is night sky and midnight or blackout or something like that y'all i have so many lip lip shades lip colors next one is number nine number nine raisin she is a step up from from brick she is a step up from brick and remember you guys this one here is brick this one here is raisin see how she's just a little deeper more purpley yes number three cherry this will pair pair well with um mamacita or hot girl she looks like this mm -hmm. but i'm just want to give you guys the like the lip combo okay just the lip combo this one's mamacita right with it y'all get it y'all get it so then we have number seven which is ruby and ruby can be paired with mamacita or hot girl too oh sorry ruby ruby boom see what i'm saying see what i'm saying girl and then the last one we have is number two naked and this one is the lightest of all of my lip liners to match the lightest complexion. There's nude. She barely shows up on me. These are on my website if you guys would like to shop them. All right, so these are my liquid lipsticks. And I think I'm going to put them here. Show y'all the packaging. Super cute, right? AMB Lavish, building confidence in a unique way. Directions, ingredients, cruelty free. Cruelty free and vegan, like you guys. And it's holographic all around the black box. Super freaking cute. I love it. So this one is blushing. Let me see if it'll fit. Oh, they're too big. Oh my God, what am I gonna do? So this one is blushing, you guys look, look. So if you guys don't recognize yet, like, you know, I call you guys my diamonds, my diamonds and gems. So a lot of my stuff have diamonds on it. 
and like a m b lavish stands for a marie beauty lavish dot com get what i'm saying it all connects with each other so do y'all get the concept of where a m b lavish comes from a lot of people be like am lavish you know type of thing but that's the reason why everything is capitalized a m b lavish so y'all get it right so hopefully y'all do because i try to make i try to make my brand you know tie in with my youtube and if i'm i keep thinking about it but i'm thinking about changing my government name to a marie oh like you need my, to <laughs> that's so yeah that's my son y'all know the one that's always videos. sponsoring my videos and telling you guys to subscribe okay, this time it's sponsored by no it's not this. don't do that don't do that no it's not <laughs> um okay but anyways I try to make everything tie back in and like I said y'all my diamonds y'all are queens you know what I'm saying like everything ties in you see the diamond here that's where AMB lavish come in at and like I said what son? this one is blushing super cute blushing is on the bottom like it silver my logo is holographic they couldn't make it holographic so I made it silver and here is what blushing looks like and once again these are my liquid lipsticks this one is cocoa which is one of my faves y'all oops y'all know I had to give me a nude and these liquid lipsticks are greatly paired with my creamy lip liners here's cocoa girl look at that look at that true brown so i got rich now rich is the only metallic mm -hmm. lipstick mm -hmm. that is in my line mm -hmm. and i did that because some people like metallic lipsticks so i got one for you all and she's a gold color she's a champagne gold and rich is the perfect name now me i would use rich as a eyeshadow topper and they're all scented vanilla this one is no guidance and i like no guidance no guidance is a orangey nude a orangey brown and i think she is so beautiful this one is adele 19 and i love adele as well she is that nude nude she is a oops she's a step down from no guidance oops sorry she's like a peachy nude no guidance is like a orangey nude y'all telling y'all get into it here is tasty and i like i'm i keep saying tasty it's taste and i like her as well i like all my liquid lipsticks if you want me to be honest she's one of those plummy nudes this one here is liquid fire liquid fire is very pretty too she is almost like taste but she's a little bit more cool tone wait let me put it right here so i can show you can you tell very bliss Taste, Liquid Fire, Berry Bliss are all in the same family. Here is Berry Bliss. Boom. And then we have Sweet Dream. Sweet Dream. Baby, look at it. Oh, y'all. I just love, I just love Sweet Dream, y'all. Get into it look why get into it baby baby <laughs> pair these two together boom boom vampy lip vampy lip and then the last one we have is frisky frisky is another nude boom frisky is in these two family so here you are frisky
I'm gonna put this back over there. This K Keisha Kayor palette. Mm, you guys, we're gonna talk about it when we get to palettes. This camera is so heavy that I'm scared to tilt it down anymore. <laughs> but this thing comes all the way down. Like, this is super freaking cool. Like, the tripod and the, like, the whole ring light it bends it it bends a lot like super freaking cool okay here is a lot a lot a lot of lip and i say lipstick but you know what you guys i'm really gonna change this to just straight lip products the label because oh and this one is uneven um because it's so I don't only have lipsticks in here. I have way more. I have lipsticks, lip balms, and all that. Bullet lipsticks, liquid lipsticks, I have that all. So, yeah, we gonna make this a part two. So, if you guys are ready for part two, which is the lip drawer, then you have to hit the subscribe button as well as turn your post notification on to all so that you won't miss it um leave your comments down below don't forget to like and comment don't forget to like comment and subscribe turn on your post notifications girl and i will catch y'all in the next one deuces